The Belmont Bruins have arrived in Memphis, Tennessee in advance of Tuesday's contest at the 10th ranked Memphis Tigers. The Bruins still sorting through equal parts pride and disappointment from Friday's courageous 77-76 setback at Cameron Indoor Stadium. Through it all, Belmont knows tomorrow will bring another opportunity on the national stage. Yeah, I think I think we're all a little a little tired of almost uh, ready to get over that hump and get a get us a big uh, win of a ranked team and and I hope we can do it tomorrow morning. Price has gone well. Uh, Coach Bird's got us ready for this game tomorrow. We've gone over all the Memphis stuff. Uh, it's hard to forget about what happened on Friday night, but. Uh, We've gotten better from it. We're going to move on from it and uh, go out tomorrow and try to get a W. Well, we know they're a lot different team than Duke. Um, obviously, they're both top 10 teams. They're both really talented. Memphis is a lot more athletic. They're a lot quicker. They like uh, to score in fast breaks a lot more than Duke. Um, so we're going to try to slow them down, try to get them in the half-court offense. And, and ultimately, we're just going to try to play our game. And, uh, and hopefully, at the end of the game, it, it, we prevail. The Bruins have four lifetime victories over Conference USA opposition and would love a repeat shooting performance from the last time they faced the Tigers eight years ago. That day, Belmont made 17 three-pointers in giving John Calipari's Tigers fits before losing in the final seconds. Tip-off tomorrow, 11 a.m. Central Time on ESPN and the Bruins Sports Network. From FedEx Forum in Memphis, Greg Sage for the Bruins Sports Network.